How much water should you add to concrete when you're mixing concrete? To answer that question, it kind of depends what your application for the concrete is for. Typically speaking, the amount of water that you add is to achieve a placement viscosity that's suitable for the application that you're doing. In reality, in terms of, well, how much water makes the strongest concrete mix? Probably a lot less water than what you're, what you're expecting. If you were to take a concrete mix of sand and cement that basically has the consistency of damp sand, such that if you picked a bunch up and you squished it really hard, it would kind of just stay together like that. But if you squish it, it just crumbles because it's so dry. That actually would be something that I would describe as being the optimal amount of water to achieve the highest finished strength from the concrete. Anything over and above that amount of water dramatically reduces the finished strength of the concrete, which is why if you need something thinner for pl placement viscosity, that's why you don't just keep adding water to achieve that. There's admixtures that you can add, such as water reducer or super plasticizers, which will help you to achieve that thinner placement viscosity without compromising the strength of the concrete. If you found this information helpful, please be sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And you can check out my website, swimmingpoolsteve.com.